It's really hard um, to put into words all that this trip like meant to me. Uh, the culture in general is amazing. I love the people of Guatemala because they were so kind and receptive to what we were doing and uh, what we had for them. I knew everyone on the trip. Like I knew who they were, I knew about them, but I didn't really get to know them until we were down in Guatemala. And the things that I was able to learn from my peers was just so incredible. So just being able to, to grow with them, to learn from them, uh, to kind of just you know, bounce ideas off each other, as well as uh, with uh, Dr. Austin, who, who we call Pop every day. We went with the purpose purely to serve. I think when you go into this profession, everyone kind of has that mindset, but sometimes it's easy to get lost in the process of schooling. I don't want to forget that, and I think this Guatemala trip will really help me to remember that throughout my career and my profession. Uh, just being able to, to go down there and serve, um, the different facets we got to do that in, whether it was setting up a clinic, um, building wheelchairs, uh, just loving on, on the people down there. Just remembering why I'm learning what I'm learning and having it in perspective and just seeing that our small actions can make a really big difference uh, was something that I'll always remember. And I think that if I hadn't gone on this trip, uh, just in the short term, I wouldn't have uh, a larger perspective on why I'm studying as hard as I am right now. Just keeping my eyes open, my ears open, everything to sources of knowledge throughout my lifetime I think is a big thing. You can learn from your patients, you can learn from your peers, um, mentors, professors. I mean, I just learned so much when I was down there and I just tried to soak it all in as much as I can. Really from the time we set foot in Guatemala until the time we left, it was all just a big uh, blessing from, from God that we were just able to be down there. 